Friday night. Make that first impression count. This is Dr. McIntosh here, sending some encouragement with Career Readiness 101. Listen, I know that every day we're given opportunity to meet. We come in contact with people all the time. Just know that too, the very person that you're meeting, it's important to make a good first impression. They may be able to help you with that next business plan, or perhaps they may be an employer and who knows, you could be working, serving right along in an organization together. We never know. And so with that in mind, just keep a few things in, to heart. Utilizing appropriate language. I know that many times we may feel like we just are entitled to say whatever we want to. However, we want to have a sense of self-respect and then respect for others. We never know what others' opinions are or viewpoints, and so we want to be respectful and not face-threatening. Also, too, looking them in their eye. When you're speaking to someone, do you look off to the side or look down at the floor? How do they know that you're really talking to them or in tune with what they are saying? Looking a person in the eye. And then also, too, if handshakes are appropriate for the setting, making sure that you're looking them in their eye with a nice, firm, crisp handshake. This sends the message that not only you have self-respect, but that you have respect for others. Calling someone by their name using appropriate titles. If you're speaking with a professor and you know that they hold a terminal degree like a doctorate, then you would want to refer to them by doctor. If it's a miss and you don't really know if she's married or not, M-I-S-S, M-R-S, M-S, it all sounds the same, but just speaking and giving that respect to where it's due. The same with a gentleman, mister, you know, it never hurts. I know sometimes we live in areas or society where it's very common to be very um, everyday using ordinary language and not necessarily that formal terminology. But depending on the setting that you're in, that's going to negate whether the fact that you are speaking very proper or if you are very casual in your conversation. There's appropriateness with it all. And so I say all of that to say, your first impression, it matters. How you look, how you present yourself, how you speak, how you interact and engage with others makes all the difference. So again, make that first impression count. Have a great day and know that the best is still yet to come.